Howdy ho guys and gals, it's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear back again here in the old den of tools. And today we got the top 10 or so gifts and gadgets for dads and grads. So let's jump into it. Of course, we have to thank today's sponsor first. And that of course is Slick Deals. This is your premier place online for going to find all the hot deals. They have over 12 million active members sourcing all sorts of great deals and all sorts of stuff, and they can help you find stuff there as well. In fact, if they even now have a an extension you can plug right into your browser. Your browser of choice, I think it supports all the major browsers. Of course, I'm a Chrome user, so I add it to Chrome, and boom, before you know it, you're finding all sorts of great deals. Like, check this one out. Over and there it is at Walmart. You go to Walmart, it pops up. Here's this deal $79 on a toolbox here. Now, we've all seen these little boxes of tools with the sockets and the wrenches and the ratchets and stuff, and they go on sale. You know, there's like a 200, uh, this one's 160, and they around Black Friday and, and all the major holidays, they may drop down to a hundred bucks. And we've seen this one at a hundred dollars quite often. $79, never seen it at that price. That is all new. And Slick Deals, the the, uh, the gadget there, the, <laughs> the plug-in, that helped me find that. And it, it can help you find great deals as well. So go and check that out. I'll put a link down below in, in the description. Go and click on that. And it's a free plug-in. It just pops right in there and it helps you find all the fantastic deals. Now let's jump into some of the other ideas. This is not a bad idea right here for, uh, for a dad there in your life. But let's find some of the other ones. We're going to head over to Amazon. These are all things that I have actually purchased myself and that I used. And I got to tell you, they've all blown me away. So this thing here, this is a piston. This is, a, if your dad is a truck dad and he's got a, a pickup truck in his life and it's not one of these brand new fangled ones that already has the tailgate assist in it, this piston attaches to almost any truck that's out there. Make sure you get the truck, the one that fits your truck. But this is, and I, and I should say, this is for a 2014 Ram 3500. There's a lot of, it fits a wide range of trucks, okay? But anyway, this makes any tailgate that slow assist so it doesn't slam down, maybe whack a cub in the head, hit you in the knee or worse. So anyway, I, I, as soon as I buy a new truck, I automatically get one of these and put it on there for $31. Why not? All right, let's jump over to the next one. You're going to laugh. I hate to say it. You know, if you've been around the channel, you know Jeff wears Crocs. They are the ugliest things in the world, and he swore he would never wear them until the wife bought him a pair, and you know what? They're silly comfortable. It's ridiculous. Uh, and, you know, for doing stuff around the house or even around the yard, even if you don't want to be seen in public, they are incredibly comfortable, very versatile. You know, you can flip them into sport mode. You can go into leisure mode, all sorts of great stuff here with them. Anyway, I hate to say it. Check them out. There, you will be stunned how comfortable these things are. Next up, the Nimbot. Now we've got several of these, and I got a review coming out on a different model, but this is the first one we bought. And I got to tell you, as far as a label maker, it is by far my favorite label maker I've ever used. And I've used the really nice Brother label makers and all sorts of stuff. But this thing, it just prints. It's so easy. It's it, you, you just pick it up. You pick up your cell phone. You always have your cell phone on. You, you open the app, and you just type in what you want. And it doesn't have to be just, just numbers and letters. You can put images and all sorts of stuff. You can make all sorts of kooky stuff. And they have all sorts of labels. Like they've got wire wrap labels to make little tags on wires. So you can tell what that wire is designed for, where, where it's meant for, and stuff like that. $25. That is a no-brainer kind of thing there. Anyway... As you can see, it's small enough to fit in, you know, in your pocket and stuff. This is a great little label maker here. All right, moving along. Next up, we've got a weather station. I don't know about you, but this bear always likes knowing what's going on with the weather. I like, yeah, you can look it up. You can look on your phone, but I want to know right here at my, you know, at my den, what's the weather like right now? What's going on? What's the wind? What's the rain? What just I well, I I'm I'm a data kind of bear. I want to know it all. I want to know it my, for myself. For $180, this is not a bad deal on a weather station here. So maybe consider that if you got a, a bear or in your life who likes to know what's going on out there. Next up, I this is this is on the I did not think was gonna be all that exciting. The missus talked me into this. The Hamilton Beach 1.7 liter. This is an electric kettle. You just fill it with water and it's instant hot water. You can just sit it there and you know what else? Look at this. It's got a base station that it sits on. So when you pick it up to use it, you're not dragging a cord. You don't have to unplug a cord. 
You don't have to do any of that. You just sit it on there and you've got hot water. It is ridiculously how convenient if you're making tea, if you're making drip coffee, if you're making oatmeal, there's all sorts of stuff, ramen, anything you need hot water for instantly, there it is. All right, next up, we've got this. This is, I, I know, it, it, we're going into summer and you're not thinking about staying warm and stuff like that, but come the chillier months on your desk, this is pure luxury, folks. Pure luxury. This is a heated, well, they call it a mouse pad, but it's as big as your desk. Well, uh, maybe not as big as your desk, but it's as big as your the work surface that you need. And it uh, it plugs in and it's got a little controller in the upper left corner and it, it, it heats up. It does. And it's so nice. So nice. I've been working in some cold caves over the winter here in Montana. And I and to the point where I didn't know if I could type or use my mouse because my little claws there, they got so cold. I got one of these and it it's, I'm embarrassed to say how luxurious this is. All right, next up, <laughs> binoculars. I cannot tell you how many times I have bought nice expensive binoculars only to find out that they have grown legs and walked off whether it was the cubs fault i'm looking at a cub right now whether it was the cubs fault or your fault or they just, just it just happened you know what so i i can't right now invest in expensive binoculars anymore and then i found these fifty dollars 49.89 Plus an extra 10% off when you clip the coupon. That's going to knock another five bucks off of there. So that's going to take it around to just over $45. These are 12 by 42. These are great field binoculars. I leave the pair in my truck. I don't have to worry if they take off because they're not a three to $500 pair of binoculars. And you know what? They're ridiculously good for the money. Are they as good as my last set? No, th no, they're not. But they're good enough. And look at this. 17,000 people have re have bought and reviewed these binoculars. 17,000. And look at that. There's no fish hook on it. These are legit reviews. These are decent, cheap, budget binoculars. And I, I hate to use the word cheap because... They don't feel cheap, and when you're looking through them, you don't think they're cheap. And at fifty dollars, you're going to be really happy with these things. Next up, we've got the Wear a Craft Four Compact 25 Pouch Set. You know, tool bears like us, we always got to have some sort of tools on us, and a good screwdriver is is at the heart of it. And this nice little compact pouch here, I carry this thing everywhere. 32, 30 on it. They got all the bits in the handle. It extends as well, so it can be a stubby screwdriver. It can be a long, standard length screwdriver. This thing is fantastic. Of course, I'm a huge fan of the Wearer products here. 32, 30 on that one. Next up, we've got now. <clears throat> Next up, we've got something a little more uh, media related. If the bear in your life is looking to do some some video with GoPros, maybe doing some mountain biking, you know, over the summer, snowboarding in the winter, just wants to go out and get some cool adventure shots or stuff like that, or maybe they want to get into content creation like I do here on on the old YouTube's here. This thing is a no-brainer. This will, you get two backup batteries here. The Telson, they're not the best GoPro kind of batteries, but they are decent ones. Uh, so I already have some GoPro batteries. I have the Telson batteries. And then what this does is not only does it charge these batteries, but you see that little slot at the back? Well, when you plug it in, you plug I plug it right into my computer to charge the batteries. It also allows me to pop an SD card in there, a micro SD card, and I can download all my data. And yes, it is USB 3 compatible. It's high speed transfer. You even have a spot up here for two more cards. I will say they are hard to get in and get out if you don't have some sharp claws. Also, here's a here's a tip for you. If you do get this, if you get the Telson batteries with it, don't charge these along with the GoPro. So either charge Telson only or GoPro at, at the same time. It's not hard to figure out once you start doing it. Just don't mix the two because it confuses the charging port in there. Anyway, this thing is, it's not waterproof, but it's water resistant. It's a great little gadget there for $38. Also, I can't say enough about a budget, this budget microphone from Razer. It is, you know, a lot of the people starting off on YouTube start off using that, that weird big snowball thing, that big white looks like the Death Star kind of thing. Forget that. For $50, you get this great little professional I, I think it's professional quality. For a USB microphone, it's excellent. This is definitely go with this one. You can put it on a mic stand. You can use it on the stand it comes with. Whichever you want for $49, for $50, it's a no-brainer. I ended up buying one of these $120 USB microphones. 
I don't think the quality's as good, much less better than that. I'm going to go back to this one. All right. Nico, if you've seen the channel for a while, you know that I've had this set for some time. I've been using it. It's a go-to security set. There's other security sets out there, but the screwdriver that comes with it is really high quality. I really like it. Nico's got a lot of great stuff out there, but this one is a no-brainer for $24. This is gonna. This is the kind of get-out-of-jail-free card. You, when you sit there and you're doing a project, you got to fix something, and you're like, "Who? what is this bit? Who has this bit? Well, you do now, because look at this set. You got them all. All right, moving along. The skill, you know the bear is a huge fan bear of the skill 12 volt system. You know, having a small, if you're, if, if the, the guy in your life or the gal doesn't, you know, if, if they like power tools and they don't have a compact or 12 volt system and you're just doing around the house, prosumer grade kind of stuff, this is the set to go with. And now it's been cheaper in the past, but this isn't a bad price considering what you get for a hundred dollars, you're getting two brushless tools with the battery with the charger on that these are fantastic tools the great compact tools i love using my skill 12 volt here for 100 bucks that is still a good deal all right moving along clean you know I've talk, again i can't talk enough about these brushes we use them all the time you know we just got back to montana we've been cleaning up the house went you know went to town on the old bathroom there we had a bunch of box elder bugs and other stuff and critters in there comes in through the vent and so you have to clean it all up well guess what you take one of these went down the missus looked at me she's like where is that drill brush thing and she went just completely nuts with it and that bathroom is spick and span twenty dollars this is and and if you're and you know grill time's coming up and I'm yet to find anything that cleans a grill as well or faster and you don't have to worry about leaving those little wire metal wires behind that get stuck in your food that's a huge issue never ever ever use wire brush cleaners on your grill all right as I said cooking is coming up and we're going to talk a cup about a couple handful pawful if you will of my favorite outdoor cooking gadgets. The first thing, anytime I'm smoking, you gotta have something that's basting and stuff like that. I got this little pot here, it's from Lodge. You just sit in there and you can do all your little sauces and glaze and stuff in there and you got the silicone brush that goes with it. I absolutely love this little cast iron melting pot here. For $26.85, this is a done deal. You just, you need to have, if you grill out at all, you need to use it. I just stick it in there with what I'm cooking. It adds humidity to the cook, and then I can use it to baste with as well. I it as I said, it's a must-have. All right. Also, if you are cooking by without a thermometer like this, if you're cooking without a thermometer, you're cooking by guesswork. Don't give me that you press the the you know the area between your thumb and your forefinger, and that's what it's supposed. To, no, no, no. Stick the thermometer in and know exactly the temp that you're trying to hit. It's not expensive. It's seventeen dollars. It's got magnets on the back, so it just sticks right on your grill there. Look, or your appliance, or wherever. It's even got a hook, so it can hang. You just put it out there, and I, I, we have one of these in the kitchen. We have one at the grill station, and we have one in the RV. There's just no reason to not have one. The, the, the Therm Pro here, it's a decent, decent quality, and I use it all the time. Also, outdoor cooking, you always need more prep area, right? And I'd always wanted to get, you know, one of these metal food prep tables, you know, restaurant quality, yada, yada, yada. And I always figured they'd be expensive. They're not expensive. Look at this, $134 for a fully galvanized, I'm sorry, not galvanized, stainless steel <laughs> with oh with galvanized legs there you go restaurant home and hotel quality 134 dollars plus you save an extra five percent when you click the little coupon here that's gonna knock it down to around 130 and they have different sizes look at it. and the price does not jump up that much 287 for a 72 inch long stainless steel top are you kidding me this is, I got this one right here. It sits right next to my grill. It's a great prep and food station there for working with the grill. All right, now let's talk about the big one. If you really love the dad in your life and he needs some relaxation time, I got to go with this because this is my secret sauce here. It's the inflatable hot tub. There's nothing like a bear in a hot tub. You know it. I know it. $4.45. They're not the cheapest things out there, but oh my gosh. There's nothing like a good soak in the morning. You know, you crawl out of the cave, you're feeling all achy and stuff, and you just slide into that water and melt. And, you know, after 10, 15 minutes, you're ready to pop off, rinse off, and you're ready to face the day. It's a great way to end the day as well. You know, it, anyway, you've heard the bear talk about these before, so you know, 
know how I feel about them. Anyway, I hope I give you some great ideas there for the dads or grads in your life, or maybe just you know a little gift for yourself, huh? That doesn't hurt. Anyway, don't forget there to uh, check out the old slick deals. You know uh, the the plug in there. Uh, there's a link down below. There's a link for everything down below. Of course, you know how this works. Uh, anyway, go check them out. It's again, it's free, and I want to say thank you again for them sponsoring the channel. It's been fantastic working with them. Anyway, also want to say a quick moment if you could if you could just take a second and say a prayer for the folks in in our area. A lot of people have reached out and asked about us. There is record flooding going on in the Yellowstone, the Paradise Valley, uh, the river area here flows right through town. Now we are up on a hill. We're perfectly high and dry, so we are fine. Don't worry about us. But there are other people, not so much, other small businesses and, and families that have been infect, uh, infect, affected. We know several people who've been evacuated two, three times. They would move to higher ground. It would come up. They'd move again. It's been really bad. And, uh, and especially for the people over in Red Lodge, that, that river went right through town for them, and it's a terrible thing. So anyway, take a moment to say a prayer for the people out there who are not having it as lucky as some of us. Anyway, that's all the bear has for you today. You all take care, God bless, and as always, shine on.